Because you bought all name brand onion nuggets. And uh, now, Boogie2988 is going to go to the fucking grocery store. Here we go. Walmart trip. Walmart world, TJ. We're doing this for the show. Let's go. That no, is we are not. <laughs> we are not picking it up. We're going in. But this is where I'm part. Okay. I mean, how fucking lazy do you have to be, Boogie? I mean, really? As lazy as Boogie. I mean, you can't just, like, walk the extra, like... I mean, there's probably spots even closer than this one. But even if there's not, it's like you can't walk, like, five feet. I mean, okay. That liar tattoo is pretty blown out. It's a, It was a shit tattoo, dude. Come on. Yeah. At least get it good. That thing's going to be gone in a couple of years. You 100% know that. gone in a couple of years. For yeah, sure. that's going to be gone. He's going to go... Ha- like, he'll probably crowdfund, like... I was exploited by locale life. Please give me this, you know, give me the uh, laser therapy to remove this mark on my skin. The f- I hate that I feel sorry for this guy. Well, you know who doesn't hate that you feel uh, sorry for him? Boogie. Oh, yeah. Boogie doesn't hate that you feel sorry oh, he for him. He loves it, dude. There's no emotion he would rather you feel for him than sorry. Dude, the views and attention Boogie's getting now, Boogie loves this. He would, I mean, dude, he wouldn't trade this for the world. Are you kidding me? Trying to feel bad for the because it's illegal to park in the handicap spots when you don't have a ticket. So, well, how can you're f- in the when you plate? don't have a ticket? You mean a tag? You mean a plate? You showed me video of your fat ass not even being able to mow your own lawn. Now, I f- think it's bullshit. I mean, of course it was. But if you're really so f- crippled you can't mow your f- lawn, then you could probably get a f- handicap Bucky tag. could easily get the handicap tag. Come you're on. 922 pounds. You can f- the tag. Go get the f- tag, you lazy. F- oh, let's go. Do you think it's okay if I get a Mr. Beast bar? Is it now okay or is it not okay? I don't know. You can't really get any more canceled, right? Yeah, I don't, I don't think the money goes to Chris. So oh, okay, you know, like I think it's. I Damn, think it that, stays those jowls, and, dude. I don't. Those aren't even jowls anymore. <laughs> Big old I mean, floppy, wow. floppy, bulbous bullfrog neck is what he's got, bro. Mm-hmm. I mean, because normally we see him facing like, the screen, but the side view, oh man. Yeah, man, no, he's huge, man. He's been like all the profit that he's making when Keemstar cuts him his check, he's been door dashing every meal, and it's all coming from Arby's, bro. <laughs> making that investment, huh? Dude, this dude's blood is Arby's sauce right now, I bet, bro. This is fat. He's a planet. Dude, you knew he he. he hit up arby's before this video you, i guarantee you because i'm like i'm pretty sure there's gotta be an arby's near it's a walmart there's gotta be an arby's he probably nearby. hit up arby's before this video with everybody and then went home and was like all right guys good show see you later and then immediately ordered more arby's to be delivered to his house <laughs> that didn't really satisfy i did a lot of exercise at walmart i really held back when i had that whole bag of arby's in front of the guys i'm gonna get two more bags <laughs> <laughs> Or boogie. And he's slugging down <laughs> the Those mountain. Vending machines are hoping they don't get trapped under boogie. Yeah. That that's a fear every he makes the game show as long as I get paid. Oh, dude, there's a Dunkin' in there too? Oh shit. There's a Dunkin' Donuts in this Walmart. <sighs> I think Boogie's gonna make another investment, guys. <laughs> this looks lucrative. Let's do a fair yeah, right fat fat game deal. And I get a million dollars. Have you have you thought about I wonder if you thought about doing like a crypto where you get I'll- Boogie's got to be 450 to 500 pounds. He's got to be. Promote it for you, Jimmy. 10K, 10K for Jimmy. Let's go. <laughs> That's a steal. That's a steal. Yeah. Gotta get the right damn chops. I don't know what we normally get. That's four chops. Right there. That's the good stuff. Dude, perfect. How much you want to bet this dude got thrown out immediately after this? Unless it's processed. Then something he had to cook, dude. There's no way I cannot imagine this guy cooking. Then does he cook at the end of this? I don't know. Or is he just like uh, taking them along to show what he buys? Because he's, so, he's so case, see if that's he's the so case, fat that he can't walk around the store, but he can't get the handicap tag on his car. I don't get that. It. Doesn't make any sense. If he has no half the shit he claims he has, it just being as fat as he is, he's probably eligible for that. Hello, human. I'm Nug. You will subscribe and become a Pessimist Productions patron. Witness live streams of Onion Nuggets every week. New Deep Fat Fied episodes every Saturday. Other shows include Abandon Hope, Ideology, Your Own, Fighting Boys, and more. Click the link.
Feed the garden. I don't normally do the shopping, no. I mean... I'm shocked. You don't normally yeah. go to a store? It's like chicken. I mean, there's only so many types of chicken there are. So... Well, I know, but like, what cut? This one's $9. What cut? What cut? What so is this I'm like doing? him showing how little he knows about actual meat and food? Is that... This is him like... doing the helpless boogie act. I can't even chop This myself. man does not is not confused about what different cuts of chicken are like. He's been to KFC. He's been to Popeyes. He knows what the different cuts of chicken are. I can guarantee you he's a, he knows what the fuck he's doing when it comes to I don't know what uh, whole, what's a chicken thigh. I don't get it. I don't uh, understand this concept. It's too complicated. How does store work? It's like Boogie, didn't your abusive mom take you to a Walmart once or twice in your life? Dip shit. Give me a break. My mom was too busy tisting my, my tipples. I oh. don't understand chicken yeah, on it. Quitted my tipples. Dude, tipples. she was quitting the tipples, dude. Yeah, yeah, that's what happened. Quitted my mom. What's the difference between chicken breast and thigh? Oh, mom will stop it. Give me a wrong noise. Feed it to the new dogs. Damn, why did he Jamaican the dolls? Offensive for the fortifications. Offensive, well, guess what? Fat dudes in carts? Yeah. They're afraid Carpenter's gonna go berserk in here? Well, they want everybody to do online you orders went? now. Obviously, in the dark yeah, of night. Yeah. That's what I want to do. It's the war. I don't like that's me. when they restock it's the Walmart. War against the middle class. It's the war against my fat ass. That's what it's the war. Yeah. You think this will get me canceled if I buy this? <laughs> Is it a Mr. Beast bar? Yes, yeah, this Mr. Beast bar. You think this will get me canceled? Let's get Dude, oh my god, if Mr. Your... Beast is canceled right now, then you are. I mean, I don't even you're know how to describe it. Like, you're yeah. not, you don't even exist. I know he's been in some controversy, but like, his videos still get like 60, 70, 80 million views. Like, you would love to be so canceled, you fat. Who gives a shit? The fact that there's a product with his name on it on the store shelves probably indicates. The level he's at versus the level dude, you're at. And right at I don't fat see guy no level. fucking boogie bar on that dude, shelf. And dude, right at fat guy in a fucking scooter level, too. I mean, Mr. Beast has got premium placement on shelf at Walmart right there. That costs a lot of money. Is this supposed to be mush to complete shit? I thought this was a bar. <laughs> Is that what people say when they look at you? <laughs> is this supposed to be mushed to complete the <laughs> shit? Yeah, that's, that's it. Is. It's such a probably. weird angle to film Boogie from, too. Because, dude, they're trying so hard to shot show off how fat he is, dude. But he is. Oh, man. He's, he's got to be his, like near his heaviest again. Oh, the enormity of him is oh, <laughs> amazing. All he's huge, huge bro. bro. This one's still a bar. Your bar. quality control is shit, Jimmy. Just like your taste in friends. At this point, I made. You faked oh, cancer. My. Now, yeah, that, you don't get to look, talk dude. shit on anybody, bro. Uh, look, look at the difference, cancer, man. Boogie l appraising. Healthy. You have a liar tattooed on your face. Boogie you weigh nine hundred and seventy pounds. You spent all your YouTube money on hookers. Boogie appraising healthy chicken. Who would is this? I don't even know how much this is. Boogie in the candy aisle. Fuck, get out of my way, bitch. Just retire. I know about you. You know what I mean? Like, it's so. You got shit quality control, bro. Yeah, he's literally like, look, let me talk to manufacturers. Where are they manufacturer? Pennsylvania? Yeah, I know them. Let me give them a call. It's like, Boogie, you're like a expert on candy, you fat. F I'm a candyologist. May as well be friends. He is. I just bought his bar. Okay, I'm getting these. Didn't, you, these are you Desi's favorite. It. You haven't bought it. She's coming home on Sunday, and there might be a few left. Find out when she does. I highly <laughs> doubt that. Not, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> we tell ourselves that. They're good. They're good. They're good. You ever tried this here in this park? Yeah. I don't know. I don't see it. I didn't see it, dude. Now, how bad did you shoot What a yourself? fucking faker. He decided against that. Dude, he of course, all the processed shit, he tosses that in. We're like, is there chicken in there? I didn't see no Look chicken. Look how long he's spending in the candy aisle dude yeah he goes, he goes i mean he goes and looks at some chicken and then immediately is like let's go to the sweets aisle what a fat worthless sack of shit dude no worse than normal no worse than normal did you see this too by the way carl's gummies that's another oh. mr beast thing oh i don't know if they're any good or not i thought it was like i gotta try it friend carl girl. they don't they don't believe we have friends come on now now well, i will say. say thank god it's carl's gummies and not chris's gummies i'm wrong 
You know, it's funny you should say that because I was just thinking how interminably f- insufferable it would be to have to hang out with you. Like, based on the banter that's going on right now with you and whoever the f- this just seems like unpleasant. Can you imagine f- having to talk to this guy and make small talk with this f- fat? F- no, not a chance. No. I would hate it, dude. I would, I, I'd be if I had to do it, I'd be miserable. It would be a nightmare. Oh, yeah. Save his gummies, take me off the shelf. I don't want to say anything that's gonna get me canceled. Yeah, it ain't so bad. You think? Oh my God! Look, look at that. I've got oh, good. God, that's only four dollars. I wonder what what Tuni did. What? Look at that. Want, One candy bar. It's only four dollars. Here's like a sample box. You don't need oh. any of this shit, dude. Like you act like this is like essential to your life. You have to have chocolates and try all the flavors we should do like a price compare we should do like a taste comparison oh, all this content. for four dollars oh my god we should do a taste comparison of all these sugary things or the other mr beast bar three yeah. and see which okay I'll well, you, you have to crumble that one up to see if it, it right matches, to see if though. it's like in little chunks like the mr beast yeah. bar yeah mm-hmm. step on it real quick yeah you can just We're pass fucking... that mountain dew are you come on what the hell? The editing on this is so f- strange, too. Peanut butter. Which maybe, I don't know, maybe, I don't know if he was edited I mean, by him or who, but... Can you imagine how f- dull the shit that hit the cutting room floor must be, dude? <laughs> it's probably the same one. I think it's when it shows how fat Boogie is. On the peanut butter? I know it's, it's well, we not really showing too much, honestly. It's, uh, right in front of you. This one? Oh, this is peanut butter right here. This is the end cat. I don't want... Yeah, that's never really too animated. You like anime? It's it's with the bread. Where's the bread? Oh, that's in the back now. Yeah. I hate that they move shit around. Yeah. You say you never come before? Yeah, how would you know where shit usually is if you don't do this? He doesn't, right? Mm -hmm. Also, they ain't going to believe I eat too much. Well, you didn't select any of those Rice Krispie treats when Chad gets home. Mm hmm. I can just get Rice Krispies, honestly. That's true. You don't I like to be Rice Krispies. So the only thing you're interested in is sugar, basically. <laughs> like, he's passed by all this shit he could buy. Uh, I can't get no tuna because I'm actually might have to. The actual... only thing you've selected for your cart is candy that you apparently have moral qualms with. And you're trying to get together some Rice Krispies or something now? I mean, this is four minutes in the actual video. I mean, he's probably been there for 20 or 30 minutes. He's, I mean, that's all he's bought is candy. Like, what is this guy even fucking doing? This, this is the international. Island. I can't. Oh, yeah. I can't say nothing. No nope. jokes, no nothing. Nope. Just keep my mouth shut. You're easily yep. good. My no one care. So I don't see nothing. <laughs> don't want any yum yum sauce? Don't get me started. Don't ramen? I mean, ramen's pretty start simple to make, right? Show. Nope, right by it. You ever have this stuff? Is there oh my a- god, candy! All right, you go right to f- candy! Is there any f- point to what's going on here? Like, what is the... Is there an objective here? No. Let's just go in a Walmart, roll around, and buy a bunch of candy. Is that the, the whole fucking purpose? So I, I, I'm a firm believer that Boogie has a public humiliation fetish. I think he's had it for a long time. I think it's one of the reasons he looks like a planet is because he likes that people gawp and stare. And now he's found his true calling. He's so raggedy, like morally, that nobody will defend him. Like if he was just a normal sad sack fat guy with depression, if he had just coasted on that, he'd be banking so much goodwill. But he's not that. He's a fat, loathe, loathe, contemptible narcissistic piece of human garbage that would literally sell up his sister's honor his mother's honor his whole family's honor up the river for a buffalo nickel and he gets his penis hard when people call him on it so he's allowing team star to like make him go in public and like show how fat he is how much he obsesses about candy how little he knows about healthy things you know what i mean this stuff's- Would you agree he's an adult, Eric Cartman? Not for a f- second, bro. No, Cartman's way smarter Eric, than Boogie. Eric Cartman has um, guile, dude. Yeah, I mean, Eric Cartman has scheme upon scheme upon scheme. It's like, even if you think you've uncovered a scheme, he has another scheme brewing. Like, Car- Cartman 
might be dumb on some levels, but he's got machinations within machinations. This guy, there's nothing. Basically, it's just a sort of vacant expression, insipid commentary on everything that's going on around him and um, a need for some like basic level humiliation on a f- large scale. Yeah, and just whining about this cancel. Like, if I heard this cancel, you don't want to get and canceled. Throw, and throwing a pity party. Canceled. Yeah, I've been canceled. I'm he so loves sad. pity. This motherfucker eats, drinks, and shit. He's a pity. Pity black hole, dude. It's what he f-ing is. And if you actually give him any pity, yeah, it, it, it'll just go into the f-ing void. Oh, yeah. thanks. It's not going to do more? anything for him or you. He wants it, but it doesn't actually scratch any itch within his f-ing psyche. Even if it does, it, it's so fleeting. It's just like the briefest of moments, then he's right back to. Oh, it's actually really good. Lots of lots of indirect kisses and such. Uh, Calories on the whole box is only two hundred. Only two hundred. That's pretty good. It's only a buck a pop. Too. He isn't using a motorized cart. He is. He is though. What are you talking about? He <laughs> is. <laughs> He's right there. That's why him. I get it. It's a good deal. I always want to try this though. Look how cute that is. I always want to try these. I never tried that. Oh yeah, get some cookies, and then there's dude. Popping cooking. Popping cooking. Do yourself do it yourself candy. I'm Put buddy, it together. Is that like stepping wow wow? Don't get me started, <laughs> no, dude. I'm going to get kicked off the show. Be. Good lord, man. Okay, I know this doesn't make any sense, but you know it was my birthday, and we did cupcakes, and we did, yeah. and Rob made me a cake, and then I had candles, but I didn't get any of these little crutchy candies. Huh? And I like these. Okay. And it was my fiftieth birthday, so I'm, I'm gonna get them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that's fine. Oh, God. Oh, that's why. It's my birthday, and I didn't get any of these little crunchy. I, I mean, I just need these little crunchy candies. I don't have a job at the moment. I can't even watch live it's right now. I'm going to need a long show. I get the cre- – like, it's – I don't know why I just zone out watching Boogie because it's just unbelievable to me that a human has allowed himself to get this low and that he can make money being this low. There's just no accounting for human taste, you know? And – I mean, it's just his taste in food, even. It's like he's longing for <laughs> the crunchy shit they put on top of a cake that's an afterthought. He's finding every kind of... Yeah, he's a f- homing missile for sweets in every aisle. <laughs> he really f- is. He is. If he he's find- in the baking aisle, he's f- by the frosting. If he's in the chip aisle, he finds the... F- you know, the... Where are, we, where are we at with our goal, Pockies. TJ? So we, just got, we just got 50 bucks right there. Does that make Ooh, our bench shit. a goal? We might be close. Um, Let's see. Very close. Very right. close. I don't 57 think bucks, here. guys. I'll check this. Are we checking Streamlabs? Yep. And. Okay. No. All right. So $57 away from Ben Shapiro, guys. We were almost there. Okay. That is very close. Yeah. Jesus. Jesus. You have like okay, Adam and chicken. TNT now, chicken. right? Chicken. Yeah. We can all win. We, it's something that's been talked about. And I think we're gonna we're gonna drop that at the ideal f- moment, at the key moment. Oh, it's it definitely come. coming. It's definitely. Oh, we're getting close. Scotty's got a f- boner for it, so it'll definitely happen. The people. Yeah, Scotty wants it. it. I want it. I'm one of the people that want. It. Look at this, Dolly Parton. I'm gonna be sick. Oh, that Dolly Parton shit is actually pretty good. By the way. You know, yeah, good. but like that's all he's f- buying is sweets, and I don't. I mean, like, I guess I do believe it. Looking at his f- physique. I mean, of course you believe it. Look at him. He's a fat dude. Like, and look, I don't care. I don't normally don't care if you're a fat. I don't get it. Who is this guy? People watch him. I'm new to the internet. Don't even worry he about it, dude. He's an OG YouTuber. Yeah, you don't even need to has, fucking struggle with this, bro. He's gone down the tubes. Let's There's no f- need. He wouldn't fit in the tubes. He's a worker. <laughs> There's, no the the There's no need to f- invest yourself to even the smallest degree, dude. No, you don't really don't have not. Also, it's on her. Yeah, now they're on a cake box. Yep. Woo. Now here's another good light snack for you. These are still. He's not one to do any little, little, little like, marshmallow. Those cakes and shit oh, would have been good. Oh, you make it yourself anyway. F- that. Yeah, it's like, oh man, I have to actually do they something. They got something pre-made. <laughs> it's like, dude, how close? Can even mix a pan. The two pieces. Okay. You know what? There's only three servings. The, look at that box of pancake mix right there. Boogie probably considers that healthy eating. If it was a stack that tall, loaded with syrup and like a couple of like a sprinkle of like some blueberries, he probably I'm like, on a diet. That's pretty healthy meal right there. 
this is 300 calories in this whole bag. And I, I mean, it's, it's marshmallows. There's a good, you want to eat a snack. It's yeah. a good one. Mallow is a plant. No, it's not. Right? A marshmallow is not a good snack. How is it a good snack, dude? It's some sugary shit. Like, if you say chips, that's a good snack. Some chips and dip or something. I mean, like, there's like, you made a little sandwich, like something, dude, like a snack, like some fruit. Hey, Boogie, how about some fruit and vegetables? You ever tried those? No. You ever heard of those? No. They come right, on. Yeah, so, I, mean, I think marshmallows are made out of mallow plant, right? Plants are healthy. Right, yeah. We get the, this is for the dogs, so we get the natural kind because it's better for the dogs. Right. Yeah. Not, not Right, dude. It's really nuts. Cause that get your mind out of the gutter. Cause what is that? It's for the dog's medicine when they take their medicine. They yeah. have to have it for the dogs. I also, I mean, I eat it too. Yeah. I just eat it with a spoon. But you get the oh natural kind. Oh, dude. What I, I do with a spoon? Man, can we do like? Oh my God, bro. This is just sad sack city. Yeah, let's get through Just ahead. like watching your like fat trailer bound welfare cousin. Waste, waste his food stamp money. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let me see what I can blow it on. Oh, dollar pardon uh, muffins? No, nah, that's too much no. work. You know why it's not like that, Paul? Because why? if I was to go, I don't have a fat trailer trash cousin, I don't think. But if I do, I guarantee he's a damn sight more interesting than this tepid. He is quite boring. If he you is just, the just... most boring ever. He is so boring i don't know i don't understand your obsession i don't understand paul i don't understand anyone's i, I don't understand him. why anyone cares him, it's I just i don't him. know there's something about boogie t there's something about him. there's something about I, you, know what? you know what i think it is maybe for me it's probably different for scotty i'd imagine but for me hey, it's like i see myself in this boogie me. i see myself boogie and down with boogie here i mean there's a little boogie in all of us yeah but I think there's a it's certain not a, fascination. Why look in that particular dark mirror, though? Because it's there, just right in front there of it you. Is. You may yeah, as well I mean, be. Like, voila, TJ, there it is. And, like, I think Boogie is just, like, when you hear about, like, you know your parents talk about, like, don't make all these bad life decisions. You'll end up, you know, in the gutter or something. And re reality is you end up being someone like Boogie. I think Boogie is just that really horrifying, you make every dumb, bad decision and you kind of just enjoy it. I think it's just weird because I think most people would be miserable where Boogie's at, but I think Boogie's actually happy. I and mean, look at him right there. He got dude, that Mountain Dew. This is good for him. This guy is happy, dude. This guy God is actually him. loving this. He got the Mountain Dew. God bless him. Yeah, uh, I mean, you have me. to do it. Good for you. I mean, you got to fucking do it. I mean, that's one of the things that will, from me, get you canceled. But like, from you, from, from me personally, personally, just personally, personally, yeah, yeah, yeah. Personally, you will be canceled. Okay, stay with me. This is popcorn. Yeah, okay, popcorn. popcorn is considered a really good light snack. Okay, in some ways. Okay, yeah. All you have is light snacks. So stay with me. Yeah. This is Cheetos popcorn. Yeah. Probably just as healthy. Yeah. I, I can definitively say that's Wait. probably true, actually. This has less calories. Well, you all you got in the snack. Does this have less calories than this. It's probably the serving size. One ounce compared to two cups. Yeah, one ounce is way 28 more. Grams, 28 grams. 28 grams versus 28 grams. Taste test. Yeah. That'll determine how many calories there are. Yeah. That's why every taste is better. That's the least calories. Do you guys think, like, yeah, that's, that's is believe his calorie allotment that's for the day is I remember just infinite? This? He just looks at how many calories can I eat? It's the infinity symbol. Only 200 calories for an ounce, Boogie. For a f ounce. 28 f grams, like you just said. That's 200 calories. So if you're asked to mulch that bag... That's probably more than you should eat in the entire day. He does intermittent snacking. That's true. When <laughs> yeah, he's right, he doesn't eat when he's asleep. <laughs> yeah, I, I get hummus well. How many this guys bought anything? You just get the chickpeas and make it yourself. Is that a fat joke? Am I supposed to step on the chickpeas? Is that yeah, it's the only way to get them to that consistency. Dude, how are they? How are they Not having him fill his cart oh, with all this yeah. expensive yeah. ass shit, and then they're selling like he's broke on the show too, though? Yeah, he buys name brand shit. He's buying all this, like he just and like the those club crackers. That was probably seven bucks. Five bucks. That stupid yeah, box five, of seven. club crackers, and it's like, oh, we get his total at the Let's end. Say his check out. Yeah, dude. What is this? Fat yeah, yeah those, those, that's that's what that means. Is he Man, buying. Really good, wow. yeah. Oh my god, he bought some strawberries. 
stuff that's actually made by nature. I don't believe I for a second that if there wasn't a camera there, there wouldn't yeah, be any probably, berries. There wouldn't, wouldn't even be... have glanced. Yeah, he wouldn't even have glanced over there. Not a chance. Hey, an, an actual healthy uh, item. As, as long as you don't eat like the whole bag in one, one sitting. Spit. Yeah. Oh, shit. There's a trash can right here. Dude. Yeah. You know what the thing is about cherry seeds? Okay. Uh, I'm... Okay. Uh, yeah. Check out some are okay. <laughs> Strawberry Milano cracker things. Nutty, <laughs> nutty, nutty buddies. buddies. He's got Milanos and Nutty Buddies and he's got Carmelo some, pistachios. pistachios, TJ, right? And Mr. Beast, a Mr. Beast Bar, even though he's morally objects or whatever the. F popcorn he's got a bunch of he's got some hey there's at least one off brand right there yeah one great value some potato chips some kind of cookie thing i think or some kind of weird nugget yeah this is all name brand except for one great value item is it name brand for good Lord, bar. how the hell is this 107 damn dollars because you bought all name brand bullshit you spent 107 dollars on junk and for it was one all person snack food and you didn't look at any prices the entire time you were shopping. No, he didn't. You know, that's a, that's another good point. This guy's broke, but he's like, literally does not even check the price of anything. He's not like, ooh, that's expensive. Ooh, that's a little steep. And guess what the most expensive items are per like per, by volume, by weight? It's, it's processed foods. This guy spent 110 bucks, basically. On, on a cart, he's probably going to eat. I mean, this, how long do you think it's going to last? There's him? almost no nutritional value to anything in this card i bet you this card is gone in one to two days if and, i mean and it's it's nothing it's just empty f calories the whole f thing there's no there's no act like there's no meat there was chicken there's no f did he even buy the chicken he did buy the chicken okay he but you know what I bet, how much you bet the dogs got that oh, i'll cook a little chicken for the dogs he ain't cooking shit all right his friend cooks up chicken for his dogs how about that it's all that fruit that's what gets you yeah, yeah, yeah. if you uh, it's all that damn produce not worth it it's not worth it just to be a little bit less fat. Good Lord. You see them tearing through there? They're coming through at five, six miles an hour. Yeah. Unheard of. You're going to hit some fat on a cart. I don't think you're supposed to bring them outside, by the way. Thank you, maybe. Answer, bro. <laughs> but... That's my advice for Boogie. Get some new malady that you suddenly have. Okay. I talk about it. That was really good. People love Boogie, dude. I don't know. I'll tell you, TJ. Why don't you, why don't you just embrace Boogie? Uh, my embrace arm. him as a brother, TJ. I don't think my arms are capable of uh, stretching to quite that your diameter, arms, dude. Your arms should be vast and wide, TJ. You should put around Boogie and say it's okay. It's okay. TJ, you could be the one, TJ. You could be someone that could reach out to him. I mean, like, you have a unique perspective. You, TJ, are an, uh, also an OG YouTuber. Maybe you can fucking finally got them. YouTube dono working again. Sent a hundred dollars on the last Onion Nuggets to be a stream live. I don't think it was counted. Oh shit! Okay, well, oh, I didn't see it there either. So sorry about that. If we missed that, you asked what's fast weird. about Boogie. It's just the same thing with Brett because how are Boogie and Brett any more fascinating than the other? I mean, neither of them is fascinating. Neither of them is remotely fascinating. But there is, but there is a fascination with them though. Well, so why, why do you think a fascination exists with these people then, TJ? I mean, because you're saying you're not personally fascinated, so why would you speculate? I mean, I just don't get... I mean, look, they don't have anything interesting to say. Okay. I mean, and, you know, you make fun They're of... They're not particularly well-accomplished people either, of course. You make... I mean, like, you make fun of... But, like, we already know every single thing that's wrong with both those So A lot of know. them are very accomplished at being scumbags. That's they true. are. That's, that's you know what? Yeah, I take that back. You're all right about if, that. If uh, Boogie and Brett Keen got into like a battle of wits, all thing, all other things being equal, you know who would who would prevail? Boogie, Boogie. You think? Yeah, Boogie, Boogie's Boogie. got Boogie. Boogie's got more like he's more that's software. One the, that's one of the things that makes Boogie fascinating to me. Yeah, <laughs> is that there's a certain amount of guile behind everything Boogie does. That is true. It's it's calculated. Like sometimes Boogie will get caught with his pants down, but when he does, he's not like you and I. Like, let's say somebody like, like let's say I went on a big streamers chat, right? Okay. And I was like, I've read every philosophy thing, and he was like, What about Kant's categorical imperative? And you're like, 
right. yeah, that like, far fetched. Like some here. absurd to that level, right? Most of us right. go like, "That sucked." Oh well, moving on. You know what I mean? But like Boogie, he goes, "Damage control. It's time for me to." feverishly look up Kant's b- categorical imperative on my phone while I have a meltdown. <laughs> you know what <laughs> I mean? So like true. that's boogie. Yeah. And so like Brett isn't smart enough to go two layers deep into the, the scam. You know what I mean? At least not mm. in my estimation of Brett. Yeah. Yeah. He's never <laughs> showed that at least not Brett Keen situation. Like boogie is yeah, not Brett Keen. As low as he really- goes. We've made all our goals, by the way, but you can still feel free to give us money like this uh, gentleman here. Thank you. Y'all should get Boogie on a, as a guest for the Boogie Gauntlet. That would have, we'd have to do it. We'd have to do it uh, via, uh, I don't know. The internet. Yeah. Or studio, it would have or, to be or online. Studio somewhere. Go on like a neutral ground. 